that it, I can't believe that time has gone by this fast. I feel like it was only like three weeks ago that I won, but really it's been two months and it's just passed by in a blur of, of, of different meetings, trainings, preparations. But it's also about time that it's time for the send off now. I'm really excited to get into it. I think once I get on the plane, I'll have a huge yeah. sigh of relief because uh, I won't have to prepare or, or pack or anything it's like right. that anymore. So mm -hmm. my last two days are really full of, of, of preparations, picking up my gowns, mm -hmm. things like that. Super mm -hmm. confident, ka. parang wala kang change of ano, being nervous. <laughs> Um, parang I'm just trying to enjoy myself because I feel if I get too wrapped up in my own mind, I'm not going to enjoy the journey. And ever since day one, even through MWP Miss World Philippines, I really just wanted to enjoy myself and That's get right. to know the girls and also kind of learn from the experience. Because of course, I got to meet so many inspiring people, whether it be uh, Sir Rock, uh, Father Rocky from the Tuloy Foundation and, and, and things like that. So, may na, may Those... ng ibang contestant, naging friends. We have a WhatsApp group na. So wow, we've, do. yeah, we've wow. been tic with each other. Mm -hmm. Parang, oh, oh, we kind of like help each other out. Oh, have you guys heard about this? Have you heard about the tickets? When are you guys going? What are you guys packing? So of course, at the end of the day, this is still a competition. Yeah. Of course, no man. <laughs> but I think it's also a mind game and how you play it. That's right. I just want to enjoy and, and get to know the girls because I don't really see the advantage on treating everyone like a competitor and then mm. not being friends with them because what really do you gain from that? I think but you lose friends that in, way. In those two months, what is the challenging thing that you I think it's just to keep up my energy every single day because syempre naman it's yes. one month um, so which is 23 days before the actual coronation night so it's really to be consistent with my efforts all throughout. Sino pinaka nakakausap mo sa mga co-contestants mo? Um, actually, a lot of the African countries are very proactive. Lesotho, Uganda, um, also Indonesia, Aruba. They're all very nice. Um, they seem very nice online, so I'm sure they're just as nice in person. May dala ka bang ano, uh, regalo para sa mga contestants? Yes, I am. I'm bringing a little gift from my home province, Albay, in Bicol. So, hoping sile? to... Sile? <laughs> I want to bring Sile ice cream for everyone, but I cannot. <laughs> the whole of Bicol is playing with the country na, you know, this yeah. time. Yes. Oh, here it is. This oh, is my little this is, giveaway. Wow. And this yeah. is from Albay? Yes, it's a little abaca bag. And then inside it has a little magnet that really has like a little jeepney, palm tree, something of the Philippines. So I wanted to give the girls something that's useful. That's that right. they can put in their bag, that they can really use. And they can remember the Philippines. Right? Yes, of mm -hmm. course. Very functional. Yes, mm -hmm. I'm gonna mind. I think you have it's one important. for yourself? <laughs> I actually don't. Uh, oh, what? So, I know. I'm sure I'll have a spare. I've, I've, I've put, I've allocated spares just in case. I don't want anyone to miss out. So, uh, okay, Megan, ano yung pinakamalaking uh, tip na naibigay niya sa iyo? That you can remember. I know it's cliche, but she really just said, be yourself. Because you're there for a month, you can't put on a facade, you can't fake. Because one way or another, they will find out. I mean, you're there True. for a month, you can't True. keep up. Uh, keep up a face for that whole amount of time. So just to be yourself and then speak from your values, speak from your core. So ano tingin mong angat sa iyo pagdating mo sa DC? Ayun pinaka character edge trait. Mo. Oh, anong edge mo sa mga kapwa kon contestant? Um, I think also it, it's my first pageant and what the catalyst that made me join was really my charity work. So I'm not just there to preach about being compassionate and giving. Like it really is in my heart. I really speak from somewhere and I think that that's something that I can draw on at any time. And I hope that the people will see that. When will your flight be? Thursday, 4 p.m. Oh my PM. gosh. I know, it's so soon. Who will the airport? Um, of course, my parents. Boyfriend? Uh, yes, he will be joining also. How is that? At least uh, you're, you're an open... Uh, Beauty You're open queen, about it. yeah. Yes, about I mean, your relationship. Um, we've been together almost four years now, uh -huh. so why deny it? I mean, I've got then nothing to hide. <laughs> So you, how, how does he support you pala? Paano yan? Everyday FaceTime? Well, I mean, uh, we've been together for such a long time. He's, he's seen uh, me through a lot of phases in my life. And four years, and I'm 22. So four that's years. a defining four period years. of my that's life right. also. Uh, every time, he's always pushed me to challenge myself. Always pushed me to, to try things. He's very supportive. And I'm just very grateful to have someone like that. Because, you know, at the end of the day, you want someone that will try to make you a better person. Sa pupunta ba siya? Manonood siya sa December? Sana he's trying to organize now with his family. His family is based in Germany, so they also oh. want to come over. So sana wow. they can all come. Mm -hmm. That's so nice. Much. Thank you so that, much. Uh, most Thank beautiful you. introduction the video. I'm so overwhelmed. I really didn't expect because um, 
I know. I, I just I just wanted to show people me. I wanted them to get the sense of who I am as a person, not just how beautiful our country of the Philippines is, but really kind of get to know me and and, and what what drives me and what uh, uh, what I'm passionate about. And to see that kind of response, it's been overwhelmingly positive, and I'm just so overwhelmed. It's almost half a million views now in two weeks, and I'm just uh, I really can't believe it. Thank you very much. Thank, thank you, you so much for your fans. Just thank you so much. Everyone, my torch bearers, you guys really lift me up. I really am carrying your energy to Washington, D.C. Whenever I'm at a point that I feel doubtful, I will always remember you guys and I will lift myself back up again. So thank you so much for believing in me since day one. And I hope to make you guys proud. Thank you. <laughs> thank you.